The principal element of the above described grinding plant is certainly the Lusha mill with its classifier. Here are the main components. An electric motor serves as a drive for the mill gearbox via a coupling. The grinding table is supported and driven by the gearbox. The material to be ground flows over wear-resistant grinding plates that are installed in the upper surface of the grinding table. The grinding bed is crushed as it passes beneath the stationary rollers. Cement clinkers and blast furnace slag must be crushed to grain sizes of between 2 and 50 microns. These ultra-fine products, in the form of dust clouds in a highly aerated condition, can only be kept under control by taking special precautions. The grinding bed is de-aerated and compressed by small preparation rollers. The actual grinding is performed by large grinding rollers under the application of high pressure. All rollers, mutually independent of each other, are precisely guided in rocker arms and are supported by the structure of the mill. The grinding table sits in a gas ring duct that is supplied with hot process gas through the gas ducts. The hot gas is directed into the grinding chamber through a louvering. The rejects drop through the louvre ring into the ring duct and are removed by the rotating scrapers. The ground material is dried in the hot gas stream and is conveyed to the classifier. The finished material passes the classifier and the mixture of gas and pulverized material flows through the ducting to the filter. Oversized material is rejected by the classifier. It drops through the grit return cone back onto the grinding bed where it mixes with the feed that is supplied to the mill through the rotary valve and the feed chute. Lusha mills are conceived to be service friendly. The gearbox and rollers can be installed and removed without dismantling the mill. The grinding plates with swing out rollers are also readily accessible for quick exchange. The components of the hydro-pneumatic spring system for the rollers are installed in a pedestal outside the grinding space, where they are also freely accessible during grinding operations. Here you see the interaction of the preparation roller and grinding roller, and also the water injection between the rollers. The schematic flow lines mark the route of the hot gas from the gas duct through the louvering into the grinding chamber. Lusha is always one step ahead.